Well, we're going to be talking today about the SECURE Act, and the SECURE Act is not easy to locate because it is part of a very much larger Appropriations Act called the Further Consolidated Appropriations Act of 2020, and that is Public Law 116-94. And most of the retirement plan provisions you will find in Division O, so they're not altogether easy to find. Uh, so the background has been that there have been a, a lot of different uh, retirement acts have been uh, circulating in Congress for several years, and for a while it looked as though none of them were, were ever going to pass. Then finally, at the last moment in December of last year, they brought up the Secure Act as part of the Appropriation Act, and it finally passed. And so Title V of the Division O of the Act, Section 401, which is somewhat confusing in itself, is where the provisions relating to the required minimum distribution rules can be found. And the statute refers to employees because the Act amends Section 401A9 of the Internal Revenue Code, which has the minimum distribution rules for qualified plans, and the IRA minimum distribution rules refer to those rules by reference. So any reference in the statute to an employee should be read as referring not only to employees, but also to IRA owners.